Now the money-making business for some moms you've probably never heard about. Tens of thousands of women sell their breast milk over the Internet. It's all perfectly legal, but who's buying this milk, and is it safe? Lisa Guerrero investigates. It looks like a bunch of shady deals taking place on city streets. Here's $40. But what are we buying? It's not drugs. It's milk, specifically breast milk. Mothers buy it for their babies. Bodybuilders drink it to put on muscle mass. And at this spa in Chicago called Mud Facial Bar, facials made from breast milk are a popular luxury. It's really helpful to treat acne, eczema, any infection of the skin. And here's my stash. Moms like Allison sell their breast milk on the internet, and it can be a personal gold mine. We've made a pretty penny. <laughs> Thanks to um, breast milk, she has a new living room set and this custom-made dining room table. We've been able to put some away for our children's college educations. Her friend Caitlin, a mom of four, was so intrigued, she also started selling her breast milk. I've made a few thousand myself selling milk. Caitlin and Allison are both nurses, and they say they're careful about keeping things sanitary when they pump and prepare their milk for sale. Buying breast milk isn't subject to any regulation, so we got to wondering just how safe is the milk being sold online? We purchased milk advertised on the internet from eight different moms across the country. When they arrived, some packages were frozen, others just cold. Then we sent everything off to a lab for testing by an acknowledged breast milk expert, Dr. David Newberg. The results were shocking. Seven of the eight samples that were acquired over the internet, I would not feed to infants. Dr. Newberg said 87% of our samples contained potentially dangerous bacteria. These bacteria that we found could very well make infants sick. This woman sold us milk on the street, all perfectly legal, but according to the lab, the level of bacteria was just too numerous to calculate. My name is Lisa Guerrero with Inside Edition. Wait, 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 we just want to talk to you. We just want to ask you about the milk and whether or not it's safe. So what can mothers who can't or don't want to breastfeed do to protect their babies? The FDA recommends going to a milk bank, like the Mother's Milk Bank of Ohio, where the milk is pasteurized. You have to be educated and you have to really know what you're doing to make sure that the milk you're uh, supplying is healthy and safe.